Hello students and welcome back to Show of Sir's classes. This is real analysis and we are dealing with more interesting sets. So we are given the question demands that uh, find the supremum, find the supremum. This is question number, let's see. This is question six. So I'll just write six here instead. So this is question six. If you haven't checked out our previous videos, I suggest you go uh, check them out. We have some really interesting examples. And if you have any doubt, feel free to contact us on 9367-93076. In any case, let's come back to the sum. Find the supremum and infimum. In femum, if exists, if exists of the set containing, containing uh, the values containing uh, numbers, in fact, numbers of the form of the form 2 to the power minus p plus 3 to the power minus q plus 5 to the power minus r where p q and r take on all positive integral values pretty interesting question so let's visualize this first so what we have is answer members of the set are of the form are of the form 1 by 2 to the power p plus 1 by 3 to the power q plus 1 by 5 to the power r so the members are so the members are let's say for p equals to 1 q equals to 1 and r equals to 1 we have 1 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 3 plus 1 by 5. Okay, let's vary R. So we have it will be easier. So let's vary R. So for P and Q equals to 1 and 1 respectively, we have this and then we have 1, 2 by 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 squared and so on and so forth. And for P equals to 1 and q equals to 2 we have 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 squared plus 1 by 5 and 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 squared and plus 1 by 5 squared and so on and so forth and for p equals to 1 q equals to 3 this becomes 1 by 2 plus 1 by uh, 3q plus 1 by 5. This 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3q plus 1 by 5 squared, so on and so forth. And we continue this still p is equal to 2 and from here we get 1 by 2 squared plus p equals to 2 and q equals to 1. 1 by 2 squared plus 1 by 3. We go on and yeah, 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5. 1 by 2 squared plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 squared so on and so forth. I am not writing any more so you can easily visualize the set we will do it for p equals to 2 we will continue this entire pattern for p equals to 2 and then we will go for p equals to 3 and p equals to 
4 and so on and so forth. Thus we see, okay, therefore we see that since 1 by n to the power p is greater than 1 by n to the power q, when uh, q is greater than p for n greater than 1, no member of the set, no member of the set exceeds 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 5 and this is equal to 3, 2, 3 is a 6, 6, 5 is a 30. So, this will become, uh, let us see, this will become 31. Uh, okay. So, no member of the set exceeds this since gradually as you can see the denominators are increasing let's say for suppose here it's increasing here and increasing here so this is in fact the greatest term this is in fact the greatest term of the set okay so we also note also no member of the set of the set is negative no member of the set is negative therefore therefore the supremum is equal to 31 by 30 and this exists in the set s and the infimum uh, is equal to 0 and this does not exist in the set S. Right. So, thank you for watching students. I will see you in the next video.